So we've done the two digit times the one digit, where we have a number in our tens and ones place and multiply a number with just in, that's just in the ones place. But I added a hundreds to it. Because we do it just the same, we just add an extra step. Now like I told you guys before, we don't just line them up and multiply 8 times 6, 2 times 0, 5 times 0, no. We have to multiply this number here by the number in our ones, tens, and hundreds place. I called it our one-way broken windshield wiper. It goes one way but doesn't come back. All right. So that leaves me with this first one. Six times three. Charles, 18. So I'm going to put my eight down here. Where is my one going to go, Charles? Above the two in my tens place. Okay. Now who can tell me what I need to multiply and or add next? Don't just tell me the answer. Tell me what numbers I need to multiply and or add. Leanne. Yep, so I take this and my windshield wiper goes over the next one, three times two, and then since I had this one left over from the last time I multiplied, I add two. What is three times two plus one, Leanne? It's six. Wait, plus no, seven. seven, that's right. Because three times two is six, plus one is seven, so I have my seven. Now, am I done? No, because we added an extra step this time. We did, we added the hundreds place right there, okay? So who can tell me what two numbers I'm going to multiply and what the answer is going to be? Hmm, Andrew. Five and three. What's the answer going to be? Fifteen. 15. So I don't have any other more numbers over here. There's my fifteen. So 526 equals 1,578. Really, all I'm doing is just adding a series of one-digit numbers and putting the numbers together. Okay? All right.